Changing the base point. The base point is the location on the shape which will be moved along as the path is, as we create the sweep. By default, uh, the base point is selected when it's lines and arcs. It's the default uh, is the midpoint. If it's a polyline, the, the default base point is the total length. Uh, uh, it'd be the midpoint of the total length. We can alter these base points. So first, let's go and do a sweep. We're going to do a sweep command. We're going to select this object, which is an arc, and we'll hit enter. And I'm going to sweep it along this path. And so there, it's along that path. Now, let's do that again. Let's go up and pick the sweep command. I'm going to select on the arc, and I'll hit enter. But this time, I'm going to come down, and I'm going to choose the base point. And this time, I'm going to pick the base point um, at the end of the path. So I'm going to pick it right over here on the end of this path. So I'm going to do a shift right click. I'll say end point. And I'll pick right on the end of that path. And now it says select the sweep path. I'm going to pick this arc. And notice the difference this time. Last time, uh, the first by default, we swept this arc along the path. This time we swept it away from the path so the object is this far away from the path. So we we uh, changed the position in space of where that thing is swept. So by changing the base point we can change uh, where the sweep is created.